Hey guys, it's me, EOD Gaming here, and I think one of the biggest questions that I've been getting, especially when we are talk about our Ronme build guide video is, what EOD, what if I don't have memories of the past at S5? I only have it at maybe S1, S2, S3, not very deep in, which is totally understandable because this is a four-star gacha light cone. Now I'm here to help. I want to give you some options as well to help you complete your three-turn rotation. For those of you who are watching this video and you have no idea why this is so good for her, do check out the build guide video, which we cover in depth about what uh, Ron May's requirements, her stat requirements and best light cones and all that. But uh, TLDR is Memories of the Past is one of her best. But then again, not everyone has this at super high imposition level and it does affect three turn rotations as it's no longer guaranteed. So here are some alternatives. The first one, as we already talked about, is Mashing Cox. This one we all kind of know. If you have this at super imposition five, it's very, very good because it gives you the same amount of energy as uh, Memories of the Past. Downside, less stats. And also it's a three star light cone for any of you who care about any of that, don't have break effect. But some of you in the comments I see in my other video, you were like, EOD, I don't want to use a three star light cone for my favorite five star character. It's just not befitting of her majesty kind of thing. And I'm, I understand that. So I am here to give you an alternative as well so that you can play her with maybe some other light cones, her signature light cone, because she can't complete a three turn rotation. And let's first start off with the first cock to the whole puzzle. And that is abundance. Most of the time, most team compositions will have one sustained character. And the first thing I want to talk about is shared feeling. So a lot of us that don't have like that super in position 5 to get that 8 energy per attack that we do, this is an alternative. Most of the time, our healer will use one skill in, for example, a 3 turn cycle. So because Ron May's rotation works in a 3 turn order, our healer likely won't basic attack three times in a row, probably will like heal once or twice, maybe heal once, basic attack once, heal once, depending on how hard it is. But this two energy is given to the whole team, which benefits Ron May amazingly well. For every super imposition that you have, if like this two energy here, Ron May needs one super imposition less. So think about it as the total additional energy you need is a total of like 16. So um, memories of the past at S5 is, is eight plus eight. So that's how you get your 16. But if you, for example, have this shared feeling at uh, super imposition five, for just giving you an example, you only need 12 more, which is like six, six, which means you can have a super imposition three memories of the past. If you use a heal once, if you use a heal twice here, you will have eight energy here. And all you need is just a super imposition one memories of the past. You're more or less fine too. Uh, that is one alternative that I want to give you. If you have at least one of this, consider putting it on. It's not too bad because it gives that energy, it helps you bridge that gap also, makes it closer to 100%. If you're using her signature light cone, one thing to note is that this four energy here is multiplied by energy restoration weight, which pretty much becomes like 5% or five or, or six, depending on how high you can go. Maybe it's like more five-ish. I don't think it will hit six because you need like 150% energy restoration rate, which is quite high. Uh, but of course, this is also gacha. Another option that I want to share is a free to play option. But downside, you need gacha for it. Because if you see here, Super in position 5, you can claim this from the Herta Light Cone Shop. As long as you prop this once at the start of the wearer's turn, 16 energy goes to a randomly chosen ally, excluding wearer, whose current energy is lower than 50%. You have a 33% chance of procking this effect. If one of them goes, for example, into Ronme, done. You don't even need uh, memories of the past. You have your energy right there. Of course, it's gacha, but one way you can get about... This is, of course, building your character for more speed, your healer for way being way faster. So maybe you have a chance to proc this effect twice before Ronmi gets a chance to have like 50 energy, for example. That is an alternative around the whole three-turn rotation. Also, quick pro quo, anyone has this at high super position is free. So that are two, two options that I've given you already. And some of you maybe don't like that. You want more options. EOD give me more options. So the last option here, I think, is an, a double harmony team. You are running run me with whatever you have. And let's say you have the battle pass, carve the moon with the clouds. Over here, this gives an additional regeneration rate of 6% to all allies in the team. This can be, for example, if you're running a Ting Yun, you're running a run me in the same team, you can have a chance, a 33% chance of giving more energy restoration rate to run me. This is, of course, very, very good for her. Uh, in a sense that you, you get closer to that three turn rotation. It's not guaranteed, none of it is guaranteed, but at least we push our odds further, which means that eventually, if for example, you're using her signature light cone for Ranme, all these small things add up and will eventually push her towards the point of a three turn rotation guaranteed, especially if you're using, for example, a S5 shared feeling. I think those are good things to consider as well. 
And yeah, this is just a very short one. If you guys are interested in more testing of Ron May live, we are going to be doing a showcase of Ron May when she comes live on the day itself on Twitch. Check us out. The video, the link will be in the video description and pin comment. Uh, do check us out. But of course, I'll do build guides here as well for you guys. So not to worry. You are in good hands. I just want to test her out live in the memory of chaos. If you're interested in any of that, check us out. If not, check out these other Ron May content as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next video.